I'm Dr Adam Carg, I'm a lecturer in sport management at Deakin University. I research and teach in sport media and sport marketing. Uh, so there's a couple of major trends at the moment. Uh, the first is really around consumers and that consumers really have become the focus of marketing activity, particularly for sport organisations. So we've gone from a stage of marketing not really be, being a big part of, of sport management 20 or 30 years ago, uh, to now being very central in terms of the products and services that we deliver and the consumer is increasingly central in creating the value, sharing these products and consuming these products. Obviously in terms of global trends, uh, we look at sort of new media, um, so things like social networking and the ability to share content and, and deliver content to consumers quickly, uh, more cheaply and to be able to customise that, uh, that content as well. So that's providing a lot of, uh, a lot of opportunities for sport organisations. Australia's really become a, a key leader in a lot of areas of sport marketing. I think to be able to generate the interest and the capacity of sport across a population of only 23 million people um, it is a great indicator of how well we've done in this area and to have so many sports. So Australia's got a, a strong history in sport management and also sport marketing. So our systems and our processes have been established for a couple of decades now and particularly our education system in sport management is, is very strong. Uh, so Deakin in particular is ranked the seventh best sport management program globally. Uh, so that's a great indication of uh, some of the quality of training and programs that our managers have in Australia. Uh, what we're looking to do in terms of our, our time in India uh, is to share some of that knowledge and some of that education uh, with other markets and certainly Australia's got a strong sense of education, really strong policies and systems and a lot of strong practices that we can share, uh, particularly around the consumer focus, uh, new media, marketing and sponsorship. Cricket is well developed in India, but what about the other sports and, and what can we do to get them more popular at both a participation level but also a commercial level? And I think that's some great questions for uh, the Indian sport managers or future sport managers to be asking is, is how do we leverage the systems which are clearly successful in the cricket sense but also translate them to other sports? Now India has seen some success in the last couple of years here. So the Deakin Sport Management Program was established over two decades ago now and it's progressed to become Australia's oldest uh, and also leading sport management program. So we are ranked globally the seventh best sport management program and the only program in the Southern Hemisphere to have a ranking under Sport Business International's annual rankings. Um, so that obviously provides us a great platform. Uh, we deliver both undergraduate and postgraduate programs uh, to um, sort of students and also people already in the industry who want to upskill. One thing that we have noticed in India to date is that sport management is still very much an emerging field so there's a lot of opportunities to develop education programs, uh, to run capacity building workshops uh, and hopefully educate and, and help support Indian organisations as they uh, explore other opportunities outside of cricket.